हेलो फ्रेंड्स टू डिस्कस वेरियस स्ट्रक्चर्स इन एनाटॉमी वी नीड टू नो बेसिक एनाटॉमिकल प्लेन्स एंड एक्सिस तो बेसिक एनाटॉमिकल प्लेन्स आर मीडियन प्लेन और मिड सजाइटल प्लेन ट्रांसफर्स प्लेन एंड कोरोनल प्लेन सजाइटल प्लेन इट डिवाइड द बॉडी इंटू टू इक्वल हाफ राइट एंड लेफ्ट सजाइटल प्लेन इज एनी प्लेन विच इज पैरल टू द मीडियन प्लेन और मिड सजाइटल प्लेन देन वी हैव ट्रांसफर्स प्लेन दिस ट्रांसफर्स प्लेन इट डिवाइड द बॉडी इन टू अपर एंड लोअर हाफ और वी ऑल्सो कॉल इट सुपेरियर एंड इंफीरियर Next, we have a coronal plane. It is derived from the word crown. This coronal plane divides the body or structure into anterior and posterior. So these are the three planes: coronal plane, then we have sagittal plane, and then we have a transverse plane. All these three planes. they intersect each other at right angle then we have to discuss the basic axis these are antero posterior transverse and vertical axis as shown in the diagram this is a coronal plane and the antero posterior axis which is perpendicular to it next we have sagittal plane and we can see the transverse axis which is perpendicular to it then we have the transverse plane and the vertical axis which is perpendicular to it now let us revise once again coronal plane divides the body into anterior and posterior sagittal plane divides the body into right and left and transverse plane divides the body into superior and inferior let's see application of these planes and axis into anatomy learning so this is a sagittal section of head and neck in which we can see the cranial cavity lateral wall of nose tongue and larynx next is the transverse section passing through the thorax in this section we can see beating heart lungs in the thoracic cage and pectoral region muscles and the muscles of back if you can guess this is again a sagittal section passing through the thorax in which you can see the beating heart in the thoracic cavity the diaphragm and the abdominal cavity now this is the coronal section coronal section of abdomen in which we can see liver stomach coils of small and large intestine and other abdominal viscera now this is a sagittal section passing through the abdomen so this sagittal section shows us again coils of intestine and peritoneal cavities this is a section passing through the female pelvic cavity this is a sagittal section in the next transverse section passing through the abdomen we can see the coils of large and small intestine posteriorly we can see the lumbar vertebra and the anterior abdominal wall and posterior abdominal wall muscles